Hi there, welcome back to uh, XYZ Tutorials. Today I'm going to show you how to control the bed in your XYZ printer. First, if your bed is maybe in the middle of nowhere and you just want to get it up or down or you want to move your extruder left or right, the only way to do this is first go into your menu, click utilities and you have to home axes first. Now the bed will go to the top. Now your menu will show this. So we can now click OK. So now you want to go to jog mode. If you can see that, jog mode. So we'll click OK. So let's say we want to move the bed, which is Z. So we're going to click Z. And so we can select by how much we want to move it up or down. So first select one millimeter so that you can make sure you get the correct direction. You don't want to smash the bed into the nozzle. So we select one and then we'll play with the plus or the minus, which is that side or that side. And we'll see which way the bed goes. So I'm going to go one millimeter minus. And what happens? The bed went up. So obviously that's not the correct way. We want to go plus, which will add a distance from the nozzle to the bed. So now we can go plus, and you'll see. Right, so it's moving down. Now I'm going to select, I'm going to go to this down arrow here and select down. I'll go plus 10. And there we go. Now just by continuously pushing that button, I can move the bed down. Okay, so let's go back. I'm going to go back. Okay, click OK. Now let's go to the Y. Now as you know, Y axis. The Y axis is the nozzle moving backwards or forwards that way. So let's go there. And again, just test it with a small amount, one millimeter. Click the minus, and it doesn't go. So I click forward. Now it's moving towards us. So I'll click a 10 or even a 20 millimeter. You can see now the bed. Okay. Let's click OK. Now X X moves your your head that way. So let's see which way is that. Let's go plus and there you go. So plus moves it over to the left. And as you can see, pressing the plus here. So uh, the point is that you can't use the jog mode unless you've firstly homed all the axes and that's so that the printer knows where the head is. Only after that can it do the calculations of where you're going to move it to. 
So that's how you um, move the platform or the head on your DaVinci. See you again.